Oh. To be fair, it didn't sound too bad, actually. Today is recording day. Quick stop at the shop to get a drink. But the plan today is to start recording our song called Sweet Vendetta. Sounds pretty sinister, doesn't it? But you have to wait. So hopefully today we'll get as much done as we can. Start with the drums, then it'll be bass. Then I think we go on to guitars. Then if we have time at the end of all that, vocals. So we booked it for eight hours, see how much of that we use. But yeah, really looking forward to it, to be fair. So I'll see you down at Supernova Studios. Yeah, well, two. I'll take you down. I'll take you down. To be fair, it didn't sound too bad, actually. So that's the drum track laid down now. That's my turn. Bass. So that's bass done. We've now got a few guitar tracks to do. So first up, it's just like the rhythm guitar. Now the lead guitar's on as well. Is the lead guitar on? So it's like two rhythm guitar pieces, they're done. And I'll put a clean version in now, so you can see that next. So that's the clean guitar on there as well. So we've got vocals to do yet. But because of the time, we've now been here for about seven hours. So probably not time to do vocals today. This is future me here editing me, who's just realized didn't actually end the video. But it also means, I know what's been recorded at this point too, so we've still got one more guitar to do. And you're probably wondering, you've seen what looks like vocals being recorded, and there's some vocals on the track. But how it's worked is that we went in, played the song in full, so had all the guitars, bass and everything, so that Joe on drums could hear it through, so he knew when the song was changing. Then what looked like the vocals being done was when Joe was actually recording his drums, Ryan went into the vocal booth, sung through the vocals, because then Joe could hear it. So any sort of vocal cue he uses to move to the next part of the song is all there. And obviously, while he's in there recording vocals, might as well record it so I can use it and also Ryan can use it when he recorded his guitar. And in a previous vlog, I mentioned that we had got another guitarist as well. He came along to a few hours of the recording, but obviously we've been playing this song for weeks before he's joined, and he's quite happy for Ryan to play all the guitar parts in the recording. But we've got about another four or five songs too, so obviously in the future when we record them, Tom will record his guitar parts there. We've booked back in in the middle of May to finish the rest of the song off, get the vocals down, then we move into mixing and mastering, which is a whole new ball game that I don't really understand, to be quite honest with you. But until the next time, see you in a bit. Yeah.